Atlanta police are now stepping up patrols at Lenox Square and Buckhead following a shooting on Friday. So this is the sixth shooting at the mall since last holiday season. 11 Alliance Hope Ford joins us live from the area with how businesses are dealing with all this crime and all that is 2020 hope. Yeah, that's right. Business owners in Buckhead, they've dealt with a lot this year from riots over the summer to COVID restrictions to crime in the area. One restaurant general manager tells me they're doing whatever they can to keep everyone safe and keep their doors open. Nothing like this has really happened, you know, in the past 30 years, you know. Every night, security patrols the parking lot where Roasters is located. It's not far from Lenox Square, which saw its sixth shooting in the past year on Friday. Officers say an argument led to the gunfire. And earlier this month, police say this man tried to rape a woman near the mall. Crime in the Buckhead area has long remained a concern and prompted the owner of Roasters to install bulletproof glass around the building some years ago. Because we have been uh, breaking into before. The glass prevented the restaurant from being broken into during riots over the summer. Some nearby businesses didn't fare as well. But even with the crime and riots, COVID is what nearly brought the restaurant to the ground. Like, are we still going to be able to work? We don't have any business to give everyone employment. Despite it all, the restaurant is still open and seeing an increase in business as the holidays approach. It's been tough and they're hoping nothing else prevents them from serving their customers. Just got to you know, do what we got to do this year. I mean... <laughs> And as far as the pandemic, the owner of Roaster says they're planning a socially distanced holiday pickup for Thanksgiving. It'll be over 12 hours and people will be able to come by in small, small groups. That way they're not bombarded by a lot of people at once. And as far as crime in the area, the Buckhead Coalition says they're working with Atlanta police and with business owners in the neighborhood to come up with a security plan that will hopefully increase safety overall. Now, at last check, Atlanta police say they have not made an arrest in Friday's shooting. All right. Um, hopefully it's a, uh, a safe holiday season. Thanks a lot, Hope.